Hi, in this video I'll be talking about the six subjects that are most in demand and then after that I'll be sharing with you my more than 15 years of experience what are my top five subjects to teach. Stay tuned. Welcome back. I'm going to provide the articles uh, in the link below in the description box. So the six subjects that are most in demand, the first one is math, followed by science, English, and then Spanish, French, and Mandarin. Yes, having in mind that most of the article that I use is from the Western world, so now I'll be talking about Malaysia. From my experience, what are the top five subjects? Number five, it is history. Number four, Malay. Here we call it Bahasa Melayu. Number three is math. Number two, science. And number one subject, top subject that I teach most of my students, it is in the English language. That is the top subject. So you might be wondering, why is English the top subject that I teach in Malaysia? Well, I can give you three reasons. The first reason is that in, since the English is actually an international language, it is widely spoken around the world, so parents find that it is very important to help their student to learn that subject even though it is not a compulsory subject in Malaysia. The second reason that English is a, a favorite subject to teach is because uh, in Malaysia, the three big races, they are the Chinese people, the Malay people, as well as the Indian people. So what happens when we go to school, although we take English as a subject, uh, what we usually do is that uh, only during the lesson when the teacher is teaching, we will be using uh, the English language. But uh, other than that, we'll be talking our own ethnic language, such as for the Chinese, it will be in Mandarin or Cantonese or Hokkien. For the Malay people, we will be in Malay and for the Indian people, in Tamil. So that is how it works here. And the third reason that English is the language to teach is because in this country, we have uh, dual languages. So usually a Malaysian is able to speak in different languages. So therefore, uh, they have to master different languages. So that's why uh, English sometimes is a language that they need to work harder in order to learn well. So there you go. And uh, if you like this video, please subscribe and share with others. And I'll see you in the next video. See you then.